scientists. Welcome back to Science with Sky. Today we're going to learn about tornadoes. <laughs> That's not all. We're also going to learn colors, practice counting, and find the letter of the day while we make our very own mini tornado. Are you ready to go on an adventure and do some experiments? Let's go! So, what is a tornado? Tornado is a super strong spinning cloud that comes down and touches the ground. It looks like a big twisty funnel coming down from the clouds. Whoa, look at that tornado. What color is a tornado? Tornadoes can be all different colors. They can be gray like the clouds or white if it's snowing or brown if it picks up a lot of dirt and debris as it's spinning around super strong. Can you say all the different colors with me? Gray, brown, and white. Good job. What letter does tornado start with? Tornado. I think it's T. T, T, tornado. What else starts with T? Hmm. Tiger, ah! train, ah! a tree. Oh, look at that beautiful tree. Can you think of something else that starts with T? Shout it out, go ahead. Wow, that's right. You're such a smart little scientist. So where do tornadoes come from? How do they start in the sky? So what happens is, warm air rises and cold air sinks. And when that happens, it starts to spin. And when it spins, a tornado can form in the sky. And guess what? Tornadoes always spin. Some spin to the right and some spin to the left. Can you spin? Let's spin like tornadoes. <laughs> Oh, it's so fun spinning like a tornado, but I'm getting dizzy. Now it's time to see a tornado in action. I have my handy dandy tornado lamp where you can see a tornado close up. I'm gonna turn it on. The bottom rotor starts to spin and all the snowflakes are swirling around. The top is starting to spin and it's pulling the funnel down. Do you see that? Oh my gosh. That's amazing. Look, we have a tornado. This one's spinning to the right. Look at all the beautiful lights in the lamp. Let's count to see how long it takes for the tornado to form. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow! In ten seconds, he pulled all the way down from the top down to the bottom of our tornado lamp. That was so cool. How fast are tornadoes? Tornadoes can spin up to 100 miles an hour. That's so speedy. Let's practice counting up to 10 to make our tornado spin faster. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten! Woo! Oh no, it's sucking me up! Oh, I'm dizzy again. If you ever hear that there's a real tornado outside, you have to get to somewhere safe. 
go down into a basement or a room with no windows. Get down and cover your head and ask an adult what to do next. They'll keep you safe. Remember, tornadoes are very powerful and they spin so fast, but we know what to do to keep safe. And if you don't have a tornado lamp like I do at home, we can make our own. All you need is two water bottles, one with water, and we're gonna put oh, food coloring in it. I'm gonna do blue because blue is the best color. Whoa, look at that. Then you take this bottle and wrap tape around the top to stick them together. You might need a grown up to help you with this. It's a little bit tricky. All right. Now you flip it over and swirl it so hard. Whoa, do you see that tornado? That was so cool. Gotta swirl it really hard. Whoa. Whoa, are you swirling your tornadoes at home too? What's it look like? Does it look like a tornado? That's so cool. Keep trying, it's a little bit tricky. Look at our tornadoes! That's amazing! Wow, little scientists. Today we learned so much about tornadoes. We learned the letter of the day is T for tornado, and so many other words start with T. We learned about tornado colors, gray, brown, or white. We got to watch my tornado lamp form a tornado, and we got to make our own tornado in a bottle. It was so fun, and I hope you had fun too. Be sure to like and subscribe for more experiments with Sky. We can have so much fun learning about all of the things about the world and science. But for now, I'll see you later. Bye. Bye. Oh no, is the tornado coming? It's gonna suck me up. Oh! Hi, little scientists. Welcome to Science with Sky. Are you ready to do some experiments with me today? Come on and time to play. Everyone play the game. Time to sky, time to sky, time to sky. Today, I have with me my grave digger bubble wand. It's so cool and it lights up. I got it when I went to Monster Jam. It was so fun. But today we're gonna talk about Bubbles! Do you like bubbles? I love bubbles. They're my favorite. Bubbles start with B. 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 Bubbles. They're so magical and shiny and so fun to play with. Are you ready to do some experiments? Let's go! Whoa, bubbles are so fun. What is a bubble? A bubble? is a tiny little ball of air wrapped in a thin layer of soap. And you can see all sorts of colors inside them. What colors do you see? That's right, all the colors of the rainbow. Red, orange, yellow. I see some green and blue and purple. Bubbles are so colorful and fun to play with. You can make bubbles at home just with soap and water. That's what we're gonna do with our experiment today. Are you ready to go? Okay, so today we're gonna make bubbles. To make bubbles, you need water and soap. We're gonna make a lot of bubbles today. And you need to maintain a six to one ratio or six to one dilution. So at first, we'll take six cups of water. We got a big bowl here and some water. We have, oh no, a little bit of spillage, totally fine. One. Two. 
to, what comes after two? Hmm. Three. water. I'll be right back. Whoa. Okay. Got more water. What number were we on? We counted one, two, three, four. So this would be cup number five. Five cups of water. And our last cup, six cups of water. Like I said before, we have to have a six to one dilution. So we have six cups of water. How much soap do you think we need? Two cups? One cup! Let me pour a cup of water. Whoa. Let me pour a cup of soap from our industrial size soap container. Make sure your parents are okay with you using a lot of their soap. Whoa, so much soap. It's so blue and pretty. Blue's my favorite color. Okay. Whoa. That's so magical. Ooh, make sure you get all the soap out of there. Okay. Now, Now we stir, and it's really important when we stir that we don't make too many bubbles. We wanna stir nice and slow, nice and slow. Stirring our experiment. Whoa, it smells so good. It smells like clean. Okay, we're stirring, we're stirring. And poof! We have our very own homemade bubble mixture. Let's see if we can blow some bubbles. I have a very special wand with me. It's a star wand and it's blue. Whoa! Whoa, that blows such big bubbles. Nope, that one didn't work. You can keep trying. Whoa, I'm noticing that the bubbles are always round. Are your bubbles round? Do you think we can blow different shapes? Hmm, let's try. Here is a heart shape. Our bubble wand is in the shape of a heart, but the bubble was a circle. I think bubbles can only be circles. Whoa, look at all the colors in those bubbles. Oh my gosh. Let's try other shapes. Let's try a triangle shape. You can make your own bubble wands at home just by using pipe cleaners or anything from the kitchen. Cookie cutters, spoons that have holes in them, anything that has a hole. Here's our triangle. Let's see if we can make a triangle bubble. Whoa! Let's try a different shape now. Hmm, the triangle didn't work. Let's try a square. Hmm. 
All right, got my square pipe cleaner bubble wand. Square. Guess what color it is? It's blue. That's right. Whoa. Whoa, that was a big one, but it popped. Oh my gosh, this is so fun. Whoa! I think bubbles are always circles. Whoa. <laughs> I don't know if this one will work. Oh. <sighs> Whoa. Bubble experiments are the best. Whoa, there's so many bubbles. Let's pop them. <gasps> pop, 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 pop. How many bubbles can you pop? One, two, three, four, five. Whoa. Popping bubbles is so much fun. Look at that one. Whoa. Let's see how fast you can pop bubbles. Can you pop them with me? Ready, set. <laughs> Whoa! Got it! Whoa. That was so fast. Can we pop bubbles slower? Ready? Set? Go! Pop. 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 Whoa, they're popping before I even get to them. I'm going so slow. <sighs> I love bubbles. Bubbles are the best. Wow, we had so much fun today learning about bubbles. We made big bubbles, small bubbles. We even counted them and looked at all the colors. I had so much fun. I hope you did too. Remember, science is always about having fun and trying new things. Next time you see a bubble, you'll know it's made of soap, water, and a little bit of air. How cool! Science is so fun. Thanks for learning with me and doing experiments today on Science with Sky. I hope you liked it. Be sure to like and subscribe if you want to see more videos with Sky. We can do experiments and become little scientists together. Bye! See you next time! Bye! Bye!